Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are going to be doing a painting for the firefighters who have been fighting the fires out here. So how I'm going to be doing it is I'll be putting down some carbon copy paper underneath my picture and then tracing over it with a pencil. Now, the way carbon copy paper works is when you put something on top of it and trace over it, what it does is it makes a black outline underneath, which is very useful. It's kind of like tracing and kind of not. But let's get into it.
right at this point, I've got to tell you that when this video reaches 1,000 likes, I'll give this painting to the Fireys. Now let's continue. As I start on the fire, I realize something very important. I have no idea how to paint a fire. So I got out my phone and searched up every tutorial you could find on how to paint fire. I watched like 10 tutorials and they all were on the iPad or how to make it to look like fire and I'm using canvas so I put them all together in one and basically it's like let the fire flow, let it go the way it wants to go because fire is this thing that just moves and sways in the wind kind of. So yeah, so try, try to do that and also if you see up near the tips of the flames I kind of made an overlapping, it's kind of like smoke, it looks so cool. So try that and it's the make sure that when you're also painting fire that with the uh, images that are in there make sure that they also capture the reflection of the fire like if you see my fireman's sleeve he's got a bit of red because of the fire and down here in his legs he's got the glow of the white fire so make sure you try to do that it will make your painting or drawing look so much more better and the fireman block out some images where the fire kind of blends into the fireman and just doing that now to kind of say some things that I really enjoy about this painting is that it was really fun to use use my talent for this and especially using it for the helmet using some opal white it shone very it shone and made it shiny that's that look gave me the metallic look, and I must say, it looks really cool. I really enjoyed doing this. The black around it is not really black, it's red black. It, it's just amazing. It, this seriously was the longest painting I've done for you guys. So please like it, and please be kind. Write down in the comments down below what you think I should be doing next. I've got a few other ones that will be coming up soon, so please subscribe and stay tuned for the new episodes that will be coming up. I'll be drawing some YouTubers, so if, if you want to see them, stay tuned!